Hey Chris, Benji Buck here. Just pulled into Ivy Grove. Going to take a look at the detention pond back here and I know that it was going to be difficult for us to uh, try to get together uh, with our calendars. So let's do the next best thing. Let's take a look at it via video. That seems to be the, the theme right now anyway. But uh, thanks for letting me come out and take a look at it. And let's, uh, let's run down, walk around this pond and see what we can see. All right, as we come off the road here and towards the pond, the first thing we come across is what looks like the uh, four bay full of saplings. Not a big issue to take care of at all. Making our way here towards the uh, discharge riser. That's the concrete thing we're looking at here. Uh, looks like the beavers have had a pretty good time uh, doing their thing here. They're amazing creatures. Uh, but they've got that pretty well clogged up. I'm going to assume this is supposed to be a dry pond, but the beavers have turned it into a wet one. That all needs to be cleaned out. Uh, as we, we kind of take a look at it again here, you can see the beaver slides. Um, there's several places like this along this embankment. So the beaver are active in here. And uh, once you get this cleaned out, I'm gonna have to do some uh, relocating of some beaver but all sides of this need to be cleaned out with an excavator. As we look back over the top of the embankment, we've got a lot of saplings and briars growing in here. There's an a outfall in there somewhere, and uh, we need to clear up uh, around that outfall so that it can be properly inspected and looked at. That's supposed to be clean. In there somewhere is some silt fence. I'll show you another picture of that here in a little bit. Uh, standing on top of the riprap, all these saplings, they need to go. So that in the case of uh, a flood, this emergency spillway will need to be used. And uh, right now with those trees in there, that's a, that's a big no-no as far as regulators are concerned. This embankment on the far side, again, it's, it's got a ton of saplings. That's gonna be a booger to, uh, to mow because of the erosion on that embankment. Um, it's gonna be pretty dangerous to sit up in there and get that cleaned out. Uh, looking further back up the hill, uh, there, you can see that silt fence in there. Uh, that's from the construction. That really should have been taken out, according to DHEC. Um, as we look at that erosion on the uh, on the slope, I'm not quite sure. That looks like an animal burrow there. I don't know whether the beaver have built them a dam inside that embankment or what that is, but that makes me uh, real scary. I don't know what's going on with my camera here. Um, but uh, just follow that around and you can see that erosion's pretty bad on that embankment. Uh, it gets really rough there between the, uh, the four bay area. But uh, that's an overview of what I saw. All right, Chris, well, I hope that helps. Uh, just a, a quick walk through of uh, the property here. Uh, it seems like there are a few issues that you need to be concerned about, but certainly nothing that uh, can't be fixed. So if you, if you have any questions, uh, after watching this video, please don't hes hesitate to uh, whatever's most convenient for you. You can shoot me an email, text, give me a call, send a carrier pigeon, however it works for you. But uh, hope to be able to uh, be a resource for you on this project.